Oh, look at that snow out there. We have some large flakes falling across the state line at the moment. A couple winter weather advisories in Joe Davies, Whiteside, Carroll, and Stevenson counties. Those three counties until nine and Whiteside until midnight tonight. So just be careful on the roads are a little bit slippery at the moment, but you know, at least we got snow. It's pretty, yes. A couple and days late. Couple yeah, days no, late. I know, a couple days late, but good food to enjoy with. There yes. we go. And we're back in the studio now with Andy of Velvet Buffalo, and you all always bring such creative food and such creative drinks, and we are celebrating New Year's Eve coming up. Yes, aren't we? yes. Always bring the alcohol early in the morning, right? So <laughs> that's why we keep getting invited back. But <laughs> exactly. No, yeah, a lot going on for us. Uh, thanks for having us, uh, for sure. Um, this weekend, starting today, we're running uh, a couple different courses of New Year's Eve specials, mm -hmm. uh, starting with uh, the two that you're looking at here. Mm -hmm. uh, we also, in, in joining these two, we have a 14 ounce uh, ribeye coming from oh. one of our local vendors, uh, Fat Bottom Farms. Uh, Dennis Beggs um, really puts it together for us there, so didn't travel well, didn't bring it, but <laughs> what you're looking at here is our uh, raclette fondue, mm -hmm. uh, fingling pota potatoes, uh, sliced apples, toast points, um, the dessert here for us is going to be a big seller, might make its way onto the permanent menu, which is exciting. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the brown butter streusel cake. Wow. Uh, it's got mm -hmm. our cranberry swirl there and then um, the honey pearls, the caviar pearls there for us as well. So on top of that, uh, we're also <laughs> running some, uh, we were talking before the break there, we're, our wine specials. Yes. So a lot of our house wines are more popular wines. We're running discounted prices through the weekend. So. Okay. So is when you say New Year's Eve special, does this include something on every part of the menu or is it specifically, you know, this is an appetizer and a dessert? So these are all going to run separately. Um, okay. I, I don't discourage getting all three of them. Okay. Um, but it's not a, we used to run, um, you have to run the courses. For this one, it's just pick your favorite and run with it. Uh, but on top of that, we're going to have our nor normal core menu, uh, our normal wines. We also have a uh, specialty cocktail uh, that's very festive for New Year's Eve. It's the Bubbly Bliss, it's a Ooh. pomegranate, agave. Uh, you stole my heart with that one. <laughs> yes, that one, that one for me is, I've had to test that a couple times to make sure that we got it right. So. Of course, that it's not poison, Exactly, as exactly. Quality, quality. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So tell us about, you know, coming up with these different dishes and specials. You mentioned that your chef is always yes. so creative. I mean, what goes into thinking of all these different courses? I think it's just downtime. <laughs> I think my chef Olivia Eckert, um, fantastic. I, my role is to just give her as much free time as possible because sure. when she has free time, she makes awesome food. So mm -hmm. um, I can only see the, the beads of sweat to tell you what is put into it because I'm not making these. Yeah. I'm not quite, I'm, I'm more of a consumer than a, a chef That's myself. That's not a bad position to uh, be in. No, though. it's, you know, it's, it's rough. It's you know, hard. I have to it's taste kind of, test on a constant basis. Oh my basis. gosh, I can't believe you have to eat all that amazing food yeah. and just drink all those great drinks. Can yes. I have your job? Uh, <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'm not going anywhere, so no. Uh, but no, we have a fantastic back house team. Um, you know, Don Dura Sue, our, our lead lines, they all put in the time to, to make these type of specials happen. We've been doing it all year, so mm -hmm. this is just kind of the... Uh, the, Cherry the, on yeah, the, the cake. Yep, the big bang at the, the end of the year. The cranberry us. on the cake, actually. Yeah, yeah so, so there you go. You mentioned discounted wine. New Year's Eve, you typically go with the champagne or the bubbly, mm. at least mm. a lot of people do. Do you have any tips or discounts for Velvet Buffalo in that arena? I would say get our Camus by the glass at a discounted price now. It's one of my favorite wines. Okay. Um, it's the most popular on that list, and it uh, definitely sells. So I would say if you're if you're a, a frequent uh, sipper of that, mm -hmm. this is the time to get it. So what, what would you pair that with? Uh, for the Camus, anything you're looking at here, I think it's it's a heavy red. Um, you know, it's it's one of those wines that with the cranberry would pair. Mm -hmm. If you want to come just to get dessert and a glass of wine. Uh, Tonight, tomorrow, Sunday, that's mm -hmm. that's for me, that's a quick stop in and out. So mm -hmm. so you all are open New Year's Eve, are you the, open New Year's Day as well or not? We are closed on New Year's Day. Okay. So we are uh, normal hours up until Sunday. We have we do have extended hours on Sunday. We open up at four as opposed to five, uh, and then we're gonna stay open an hour later. Oh, so. wow. That's good. I'm going to go eat all of this now. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> do you so recommend good. people make reservations? Do you think you'll have space for walk-ins? It's getting pretty tight. Okay. So I would say sooner than later is, mm -hmm. is best. Uh, make your reservation now. Um, we have plenty of room tonight, tomorrow, Saturday. Sunday is getting pretty packed up. They're pretty good. So. Would you recommend a big group or to come in a smaller group? It's a pretty intimate space. So smaller groups are preferred. Uh, can't really accommodate your larger parties. Uh, <laughs> that's more of a rooftop vibe, mm -hmm. uh, which we'll also be running um, 
the same drink special, the Bubby Bliss, and then on top of that, we're going to be doing a for the first time Oysters Rockefeller on the rooftop as well. So, oh, that's fun! Yes. That sounds exciting. And then you are finishing off the month of December with your cocktails for a cause, yes. and that's been going on all month long. That's a pretty cool promotion. It's very cool. That, that that's that's what makes our job easy, right? Mm -hmm. So that's one. Um, is slinging our drinks, but for a good cause. So yeah, that's uh, a partnership with Tito's. Uh, we're running a couple select um, festive cocktails that um, my bar manager, uh, Kirsten, and her team put together. Um, and for every cocktail sold, a dollar goes towards Cancer Coalition. Um, and then Tito's is gonna match that dollar for dollar. So. Oh wow, is this the first year you guys have done a cause like that? Or have you done something like that in the past? So this is, this is something that we've done in the past. Um, We've changed our cocktails and our approach since. Uh, it's this year, I felt like was uh, at least for Velvet Buffalo the, the most well executed. Mm. Um, also, the the highest uh, regarded drinks that we put out. So the Tinsel Teeny for me is my favorite. Tinsel Teeny. So, What's in that? You don't even know, and you're like, yeah. I want it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it sounds delicious. So it sounds like I have to make a reservation for you soon. <laughs> yeah. Immediately so after I this. will be there um, yeah. <laughs> in three hours. There you go. Okay. Take the tour. Yeah. Yes. Definitely. So what is the tinsel tea? The tinsel tea is our uh, approach to an espresso martini. Okay. Um, it is um, Tito's infused uh, butter, or it's butter, uh, scotch, Tito's infused, wow. uh, but it has uh, shots of espresso in it. Uh, we rim it with a little butterscotch candy. Um, mm, it's, it's quite tasteful. <laughs> Yummy, and it keeps you up for the night. Yes, there you go. There you go. <laughs> ball drop. I don't know if that's the Tito's or the espresso, either way. Yeah, cool. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Andy. You always make our job easy with the go. delicious foods that you bring and drinks as well. Again, you can visit velvetbuffalo.com to make those reservations or call the number on your screen. They're going fast, so act quick. Thank yeah, I might again. steal all the reservation. There we go. Yeah, you I'm get genuinely the, concerned get about the direct Kayla. line. <laughs> no, don't hurry. be concerned. I'm just going to come back with 20 different cocktails for everyone. Okay. How'd you get well, on the VIP list? <laughs> I'm down. There we go. Thank you, thank you, Kaylee. Thank you, Andy. We'll be right back.